Hi, this is Joel at welcome back sa aking YouTube channel. Ngayong araw ay pag-usapan natin ang tungkol sa Silago Southern Leyte, the history of Silago Southern Leyte. Pero before we continue our video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel at click ang notification bell para lagi kang updated sa aking YouTube channel. One, two, three, come on! Hi, at ito na mga ka-channel. Simulan na natin ang history of Silago Southern Leyte. Silago has ebony beach with unique black sand. Silago is a fourth class municipal when it comes to income. According to 2015 census, Silago Southern Leyte has a total population of 12,775 and 3,096 household. Silago has 15 barangay, namely Balagawan, Katmon, Katipunan, Hingatunggan, Imelda, Mercedes, Poblacion District 1, Poblacion District 2, Salvacion, Sapang, Tubaon, and Tubod. Silago became municipal on May 17, 1951 through Executive Order No. 326 issued by President Elpidio Quirino. Silago is located in Region 8, Eastern Visayas. Silago has a total voters of 9,700 as of 2019. The density of Silago is 59 km per square or 150 square miles. The land area of Silago is total of 215.05 km per square or 83.03 square miles. Language to be spoken in Silago Southern Leyte, Buholano, Cebuano, and Tagalog. Natural attraction, Piladara, Tree Park, and Skeletal Whalebone, and many others. The name Silago was shortened as Spanish Moor Silago of Bat, referring to an account with the Spaniards encounter bats in the area perching in trees locally known as Tuog. The native replied the incomprehensible question of the name of their place asked by the Spaniards saying, Tu ay daghang kabog. In the belief that the Spaniards were amazed the huge number of bat present in the area that time. The place was then called Moor Silago and over time was shortened to its present name Silago. However, accounts from Figafita on, on the Magellan voyage indicate a certain island in later recorded as Sinalu along with the recorded Hinangar or Hinunangan and Abirian or, or Abirian as known as Kabalian, which is a new presentation by Greg Hondaveros on the first mass controversy published in 2008, designated it to the Hingatungan point in the town and therefore not an island as the account indicates. During World War II, Silago was chosen as the site of the submarine landing of American military arms and equipment for the Leyte guerrillas. The military hardware was efficiently moved to the Leyte by hundreds of volunteers under the Leyte Area Command of Lieutenant Roberto Kikang Leon. After the Second World War, Silago became more progressive and had increased its population, and thus became the biggest barangay of Hinunangan. Progress served as a pushing factor that Silago has availed and gained qualification to become a municipality. In 1948, the Secretary of National Defense, Roberto Canglion, worked hard for the conversion of Barrio Silago to a municipality. Finally, on June 20, 1950, the new municipality of Silago was inaugurated by virtue of an Executive Order No. 326 issued by Elpidio Quirino. Such executive order was charted through Republic Act No. 596 to creating the municipality of Silago in the province of Southern Leyte on June 21, 1969. At hanggang dito na lang po ang aking video. Huwag kalimutang mag-click at mag-subscribe sa aking YouTube channel. Mabuhay at maraming salamat. One, two, three.